Hello everyone. Getting out and about here around Sharpsburg this spring. Thought I'd give you a shot of what's growing in and what's looking so nice for this time of year, but oh, we got to throw a little bit of history in there. During the fighting here at Sharpsburg, in front of you along that green manicured path of uh, pathway, actually that's the road, but we're talking about the road that leads out of Sharpsburg heads to the lower bridge and crosses the Antietam at the lower bridge or what everybody calls now the Burnside Bridge. So you can see on the right there's a roof top and to the left around that picket or that fence there you can see the top of the roof of a house. This road is the old original road from Sharpsburg that goes down between the mill on the right and the house on the left and then eventually goes down in front of the auto house and goes to the lower bridge. This is all privately owned that we're looking at now, so uh, don't get me in trouble by coming up here and tramping all through their backyard. But I'm gonna swing around here and follow and show you what is available to you. This is the town of Sharpsburg owns this bit, and this flat level spot is the back end of the roadway that heads to Sharpsburg. This is the old road from Sharpsburg to the lower bridge, and at the time of the fighting, this was incorporated with Jenkins Brigade of Confederates that had dropped back between the Sherrick Farm and the Solomon Lum Mill and dropped back to here in reserve. And across the way, there's the pond, the modern pond, I call it. That's about 70 years old or so, better as a wild guess. Across the road, of the modern day Burnside Bridge. The house there that you see is in the Avey Farm Orchard. That's significant because up behind there is James Kemper and Thomas Drayton's brigades under D.R. Jones, south of Sharpsburg, with the limited defenses here at the time, the afternoon of Sharpsburg. We can see across the way through the trees a little bit. I don't fall over and hit my head. There's a green tree line. That's the 9th New York Monument, Hawkins Zouavs. That shows in a rough spot what we call the high water mark here at Sharpsburg. So it is significant. It's a place you can visit. Uh, if you want to come fish a little bit and walk this trail, uh, have at it. It's all owned by Sharpsburg in the town. The National Park is up on this side. You can see the fencing and the stone wall build up. So a nice little place to see on your way here to Sharpsburg. So one more spot to get this place under your feet. Have a good day and stay safe.